Jarman holds a very special place in the world of art and film and as a campaigner for the rights of people's freedom to be who they want to be. We shared studio premises from 1968 to 1979 and Butler's Wharf was our largest and final building. This plaque is blue, I hope. And now strangers may glance up I wonder, who is this Jarman animal? Who was he? You will light up bulbs of curiosity and strangers will Google, search and retrieve fragments of your own life and they'll learn about your brilliance and your art and your life of poetry and colours and I'll remember your laugh. I miss you, so please do come back soon and make some iPhone X films. We need you more than ever. Lots of love, Simon. I can remember when, when Outrage was first set up, one of the things we didn't have was a fax machine. And as soon as Derek heard that, a fax machine was duly delivered. He was kind, he was generous, he was supportive. And he put himself on the line. He was a trailblazer in every aspect of his life and work a fierce critic of everything conventional and orthodox, a true innovator in any and every way. One of his favorite quips was from Dorothy Parker, quote, heterosexuality is not normal, it's just common. <laughs> I'm honored to have had Derek as a friend and comrade. Thank you. <laughs>